Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a hot minute since I posted a video and I'm sorry, just wasn't feeling it. So I took a break. Um, hopefully you're not too mad at me, <laughs> but I am just gonna film my day today. I don't have work, but I do have a lot of stuff to do. I have class this afternoon. Um, we're studying for a test in my psychology class and my philosophy class. I just, yeah, the usual, gotta go to it, but. And then after class, I have to stop at Caribou. I got a job there. So I have to stop in and um, they got to make copies of my social security card and my driver's license. And then we're going to get my schedule figured out because my last day at Kohl's is next Wednesday. Another woo-woo because I can't wait to get out of there. Sorry, Kohl's, but it is what it is. And then I have to go to Walmart to pick up a grocery pickup. Um, I like have no food in my apartment and that's a problem because I have not been eating very well. It's like the most random things. I think the other night after work for supper, I had toast and Oreos. Yeah, I have some homework to do today because I didn't do any homework yesterday. I had field experience from 12 to 2. I haven't told you guys about that. So I am in a class, a fifth grade class at a middle school, like 10 minutes away from my apartment. I go there two days a week, Mondays and Wednesdays from 12 to two and just observe, help out around the classroom. Um, eventually I'm gonna have to teach my own lesson. Um, I think I'm gonna start taking over some like small things in the class. For example, I think I'm gonna do their spelling pretest on Monday, which is really exciting. I, I love it, I'm so excited about it, but. Um, yeah, I had that yesterday and then work at three, so I didn't really have much time to do any homework, which is fine. I'll just do it today. But um, I need to plan out next week because I won't have time to do it tomorrow. I work from 8.45 to 3, so I'm just going to go home right after. And when I get back on Monday or Tuesday, I want to have everything just planned out already so I don't have to worry about it. And I need a pack for the weekend because I'm going to go home right after work tomorrow. And I have a big weekend this weekend. Friday, I'm just going to hang out with the family. Um, Saturday, I'm working at the flower shop. I don't think I told you guys about that either. I started working at a flower shop. It's actually my boyfriend's aunt's flower shop. So I get to hang out with her. It's really fun. And, you know, be around pretty flowers all day. I love it. Not sure what I'm doing Saturday afternoon after work, but whatever and then Sunday I am going to Kansas City with Carson because I got him NASCAR tickets for his birthday so we're going to the NASCAR race there and we're leaving at like five in the morning because it's a five and a half hour drive and we're gonna go to the race um it's supposed to rain so hopefully it doesn't get canceled or postponed Carson said it might get postponed till Monday which is fine because we have a hotel for Sunday night because we don't want to drive back right after the race. So if it does get postponed till Monday, we'll just explore Kansas City on Sunday, go to the race on Monday, and then come home after the race. So either way, it will be fine. But yeah, let's pray for no rain and a smooth weekend. But yeah, I have that going on on Sunday. I probably will vlog my weekend because I think it'll be a fun weekend. So hopefully you guys will get to see that. And then my dad just got a new truck and he has been bringing it back and forth from Cedar Rapids, Iowa City, just like getting stuff put on it. And I think today is his last appointment. I'm not 100% positive, but he, I think he brought it up here to Cedar Rapids last night and he has to pick it up today. So... I just need to give him a ride home when he picks it up. So I'm gonna do that. Um, I'll probably pick him up from the dealership and then bring him home. And I probably will come back up here after because I work in the morning and I don't wanna be up earlier than I need to. Yeah, that's the plan for today. I already had or am having my coffee. Um, 
I'm not super hungry, so I probably won't have breakfast yet or at all. Coffee fills me up, so yeah, I'm not super hungry, but I'm gonna get started on some homework, maybe watch some YouTube, but I have class at 11, so I have like an hour-ish to do some stuff and then I will head to class, but yeah let's get into the okay i put a sweatshirt on because it's chilly today it is gonna be fifth the high is 50 something i believe so it's like 40 degrees out which is probably the coldest day we've had so far like our summer definitely lasted a lot longer which i'm not complaining love it but actually chilly out today so i put a sweatshirt on because i was cold to start my homework I'm gonna read chapter one of this book for philosophy, philosophy, because he makes us do reading quizzes every day, class, to make sure we read the book, <clears throat> which I've been doing really bad on because these books are just really hard to understand. So like, I'll read it, but then like, I don't understand it, so then I just do bad on the quiz. But I got a 93% on our midterm. So like, that's saying something. He should know that I know the material after we talk about it. But it's hard for me to know it by myself. So, yeah, it is what it is. But I have to read chapter one before class today. So I'm going to do that quick. Shadows of the morning are crawling on my floor. When I just want to lie here. I have absolutely no idea what I just read. So, pray for me on the reading test today, because that's not gonna go good. Hopefully I'm good at guessing. But now I am going to um, some stuff on my laptop for homework, and then it'll probably be time for me to go to class, so yeah. I've been sleeping too long. I've been dreaming too long. And I just wanna lie here. But I don't want to die here So I'm gonna take my best shot Shot out of bed into the tip top Sitting on the edge of my bed Waiting by the river Alright, finished my homework for now um, I need to get going so I can make it to class on time But I wanted to show you the fit for the day Ball check trucking sweatshirt, of course Support local Um, I got these leggings from TJ Maxx, I think and then Nikes for my shoes. Yeah, very chill and comfy. All right, let's go to class. It is freezing out and I'm not a fan of it. Yeah, it's cold out. I probably could have put a jacket on over my sweatshirt. Oh yeah, sorry. I'm gonna head to campus and I will talk to you when I get it. With this melody in my head, shout out a bit cause I got something to prove. So when I say, mama turn the light on, understand just what I mean. When I'm asleep, I will dream. And when I wake, you will see that even as I lie here, thinking where I'll be in five years, I know today is all I ever got. I know today will be my best shot. Sitting on the edge of my bed. Right. So I'm done with class and I forgot to update you guys when I got out of class, but I'm at Caribou now. Um, I just realized I don't have my social security card. It's at home, like home home. So I only have my driver's license. Um, so hopefully that's okay. But I'm gonna run in there and get that done and then I'll go pick up my groceries from Walmart. Okay, got everything done. They don't need my actual social card, so that works out good. Um, and my first day is next Friday from 7 to 1. So I'm super excited. And yeah, so now I am going to go pick up my groceries and then go home. Because I have some stuff to do with like taxes and stuff for Caribou, like at home on my laptop. So I'm going to do that. And then call my dad and see what time he needs me to give him a ride home today. So yeah, okay. I'm at Walmart now waiting for them to bring out my groceries but i wanted to let you guys know since i'm an employee at caribou now i should start promoting their products but they give you a free drink every shift or like every time you're in there 
So I got a hot chai latte because it's freezing outside and I wasn't feeling coffee and it's freaking bomb. I should have got a pumpkin chai though because their pumpkin chais are super good. I got an iced pumpkin chai last time I was there. So like a hot pumpkin chai would probably be immaculate. But I'm waiting for them to bring my groceries to me and then I'm gonna head home unload them and make something for lunch because I'm starving. It's 2.50 and I haven't ate lunch yet. And all I had for breakfast was that like granola bar that I showed you guys when I was in between classes. But yeah, I'm gonna head home so I have to pee so bad and I'm like shaky because I'm hungry and it's just not, it's not the vibe. Alright, I just unloaded all my groceries. Not a huge haul, but yeah. Here's what I got. Bread, because I needed bread. Um, tin foil, we're all out of tin foil and that's a necessity. Chips and French onion dip, because mm, bomb. Uh, mac and cheese, obviously. I got a lemon and some parsley, because I'm gonna make shrimp linguine this week and it needs those. Shredded cheese, I use it on everything. Parmesan cheese, also for the shrimp linguine and just to have. Cold brew, of course, ketchup and Western just because I use them a lot and I'm out. These Builders protein bars from Cliff, they're super good and they fill me up. So I like to have them as like in between class snack. These protein yogurt shakes that I also like to have for a quick snack. Um, yogurt because I have a bunch of granola I need to use, so I got that. Vanilla almond milk and chai concentrate so I can make my own chai lattes at home. This cheesy potato bake that I'm gonna have for supper tonight because I wanted something quick. Um, this berry medley of frozen fruit for smoothies or like to put on oats or something. And that's it. So yeah, I'm gonna put this away. All right, little update. Um, I no longer have to help my dad out tonight. I just called him and he was like, oh, I already did it, blah, blah, blah. Like, thanks for telling me, dad. You know how dads are now i don't have any plans for the rest of the evening um i need to write one more philosophy journal to get like back on track because i got behind the last few weeks um i still need to plan the next coming week and pack for the weekend but that's not going to take me all night so i'm not really sure what i'm going to do i might relax i might go to the gym i don't really know what i'm going to do but i'll keep you updated um for now i'm going to keep doing homework like i have been yeah, you my sunshine mixed with a little hurricane. White hot angel with the dead devil's brain. There's feeling I just can't fight it. You know all the ways I like it. My north, you my south, you my east, you my west. When you see me at my worst, try to make me feel my best. There's love, we can't deny it. Okay, I am done with homework for the week and I don't usually have no plans so like I don't know what to do but I decided not to go to the gym. Let's be honest, we all saw that coming but I'm just gonna have a little self-care evening. I need to paint my nails because they're super chipped and yeah I'm gonna do that, paint my nails and I'm gonna get caught up on YouTube videos because I haven't watched YouTube in a little bit and all my people have posted new videos. Um, my current fave is Hannah Elise. Um, she is awesome. She's so real, like authentic. And she just got her own apartment and moved to New York City. So I'm watching um, her series. It's, she calls it Post Grad Diaries, episode four. She, it's her last weekend at home apartment shopping and packing. So. I am gonna watch that and paint my nails. And I don't want to waste my days with no one else. I love how it feels. Killing time, you and I. Hours, minutes, days, and nights. Trading all of our deadlines for conversations over wine. Killing time, you and I In this moment, we're alive Infatuated with your eyes And the way they look at mine When we're killing time uh -uh. Okay, 
it is like 4 40 and i'm starting to get hungry already i've been waiting for my nails to dry before i did this they're pretty much good but i'm gonna make this cheesy potato bake um super easy okay i need to pre the oven to 375 um, I'm gonna let that preheat and then it's gotta go in the oven for 65 minutes. So a little bit over an hour, which is fine because then I can just, I'll take a shower while I'm waiting. So that's fine. But I'm gonna let that preheat, pop this in the oven and then go take a shower. All right. I took a shower and watched TV for a little bit, but supper is almost ready. So I'm gonna brush my hair quick before I eat so that after I eat, I can just do whatever. So don't worry about my hair. So I'm gonna do that. Um, I'll show you the products I put in it quick. Cause I haven't shown you guys it a hot thing. So before I brush it, kind of like to help detangle it, so brushing it isn't that hard, I use this leave-in conditioner from the brand As I Am. This stuff, I got it from my mom. It smells so good and it works amazing. Um, so I just put a little bit of this stuff in my hand. A little bit goes a long way with this stuff. Like, I have pretty thick hair and that is all I need to cover most of it. So I just will flip my head over and then just like scrunch it in all over. Especially the ends of my hair. Then I wipe off my hands because they get all greasy. And then I'll brush it. And I use the um, wet brush, the one with the air, so it can ventilate, I guess. Um, but it works really good. I love it and it doesn't hurt my hair when I brush it. Regular brushes do. So I start at my end and then I just move up one side and done. And then I'll do my other side. Okay, all the knots are out of it now. And to like seal in the conditioner, I use the Kristen S Weightless Shine Leave-In Conditioner. Um, it's like a spray and it's moisture sealing and shine enhancing. So yeah, I will put my hair over, spray it and then like scrunch it so it's not stick straight like this. So just shake it up and then put a few sprays in it. And then I just kind of you know, make it so it like sits naturally on my head rather than like I just brushed it. And I feel like it gives it more volume that way, but this is the finished product and that combination makes my hair so freaking soft when it dries um and i usually let it air dry i don't ever use like a blow dryer or anything but yeah that's all i do for my hair let me show you my dinner before i eat it i am freaking starving i'm so excited not the healthiest i know i don't really care but i just got some ham and cheesy potato casserole and then some baked beans and that's what's for dinner i'm gonna grab a fresca to drink with it i love this stuff it's just sparkling soda water the grapefruit citrus um and it's like not as bitter as like a bubbly is it has a little bit more sweetness to it but they're so good so i'm gonna have that end this video here um i'm starting to get super tired i've just been watching tv for probably like the last hour but i like to read a book to end my night so i am gonna read a little bit of the book i'm reading right now which is the boy who knew too much it's about like past lives and this little boy who like was a baseball player in his past life and like remembers it but it's really interesting but i'm reading that right now so I am going to end the video and read and then go to bed. But I appreciate you watching and I will see you in my next video.